Hey, this is CTD97 again with another review. Sorry for the vacuum. But, um, let me close the door the whole way. Today, I will be doing the old, um, at, -AT. And, yes, I'm getting the new at, -AT for Christmas, but I've had this one since last Christmas. Four days after I got this, I realized of the new at, -AT. But, oh well. It's still a good vehicle. Um, unlike, I will be doing a new, I'll do a comparison, but right now, I'm just going to try to knock off as many vehicles as I have as possible. Um, I got mine at, like, a collectible shop, and it was open, so it doesn't have everything. But that's what it looks like on the inside. And on the other side, the chin guns and the cheek guns, the eyes, and oh, that's why. And that. Um, the legs, as you can see, are, um, let's just say. the size of my forearm and yeah it's actually really big and remember back then like I think this is the vintage one tell you the truth because I think the cheek guns are different for the power of the force but just remember that back then they didn't have like a lot of plastic and well I mean they did but it's not like today um I like that they had this, like, so you can stick a gun out or open it really easily. And then it just flaps down. It would have been nice to for it to come with a ladder. You can even kind of see. I just realized that right there it looks like there's supposed to be a ladder. Like, not supposed to come with it, but, like, they were trying to make it look like they it had one. Um... The bottom ankles, I guess, look like that, and the knees look like, well, that was the arm part. Hold on, I can't do this all at once. Okay. So... That's what it looks like, and this is what the ankles look like. It doesn't make the best noise, so you can't be playing at night time whenever your parents walk in or something like that. Uh, there's the neck, and here's the inside. And there's the handle right there. And you just push that, and it goes up. And you move it from side to side, and the head goes side to side. I thought it was just so cool. And you saw that little button right there? I don't know if the batteries are good. Nope. Um, yeah, they're working. Usually they have to get warmed up, like they're kind of starting to get a little bit better. You can't really see the lights, but... Whenever you put a whole, whenever you put new batteries in it, it looks a lot better. Anyway, um, I think that's all with this vehicle. I mean, let me just show you what it looks like with one of the modern stormtroopers in it. Um. Like, again, I said, I love this feature. Uh, you can have, like, a little drive-by. Like, just put a wampa there. Shooting him. But, and that's also for a thumb hold, so I really like that feature. Um, this is the size comparison. 
So it's pretty big, but not even nearly as big as the new one. Um, it looks pretty awesome, I think, with the new stormtroopers in it. I think I'm going to try to find as not as much as these as possible, because they're just they're just awesome. I I know I've said that so many times, but I think they're just the best. Um. Well, thanks for watching, and may the force be with you. And keep on subscribing, and keep on uh, buying. Bye.